In Baton Rouge last month, David Fung, a land surveyor by trade, demonstrated he's pretty good in the water, too, saving a dog and her owner from floodwaters. Well, this week, all three were reunited. Here's Omar Villafranca. In the middle of August's historic Louisiana flood, give me a knife, give me a knife. 27 year old David Fung jumped into the raging waters in Baton Rouge to rescue a woman in this red car, sinking to her certain death. She had gotten into a deep part of the water, and uh, that's where you see that the car started to sink. She was actually about to be in real, real trouble. In the chaos, Fung managed to pull 53-year-old Haley Brulette out to safety. But he wasn't finished with his rescue operation. So I took one deep breath and gave it one last try and was able to retrieve the dog. I got dog. Oh! Roulette had just gotten out of the hospital after kidney surgery. She was on her way to pick up medication when she drove into the floodwaters with her trusted dog, Sassy. I was more scared for her than anything. More scared for her. A month after her brush with death, Brulette is still homeless. It's so hard to store over. It is. Because you don't know where to store it. Hopefully that don't happen. Sassy. Oh, you it does. This week, she was reunited with the stranger who rescued her. He brought her supplies and dog treats for Sassy. I think it is divine intervention. I believe that in my heart, my soul. Proving the only thing that can match Mother Nature's worst is human nature's best. It's just who we are in Louisiana. We, uh, we help people in times of need, and I was put in that place to help her out. Omar Villafranca, CBS News, Denham Springs, Louisiana. Unsinkable Sassy. That's the CBS Evening News for tonight. For all of us at CBS News all around the world, good night.